Before I start this review, I'd like to say a big thanks to everyone. Uh, I did a sausage rolls, I made some sausage rolls yesterday and I got, I've had over 750 comments. Thank you all very much. Great comments. It, it means a lot. Thank you very much. I, I did try my best. Uh, and I think they worked out well, those sausage rolls in the last video. Kids uh, enjoyed them and my wife uh, enjoyed the one that she had. So, yeah, more cooking to come. Uh, anyway, I've been to Aldi and uh, I hope you're all spot on. And I've uh, bought this. And here it is, I'm new. Uh, two steak and ale pies. Tender beef in a puff. Longhorn IPA gravy topped with golden puff pastry sprinkled with cracked black, black pepper. Um, we've got a little traffic light system there for the nutrition. Ooh, chips. Uh, yeah, and there is a serving suggestion. Now, are these new? <laughs> you know what Aldi are like, putting new on everything. So they were £1.99, so pound a pie, or just under. So let's take a look at the box. I do like a pie. <laughs> uh, let's go around the back. Oh, it's all right. It's not like the front. So we've got some spiel at the top there. It says beef cooked in craft ale gravy filled into a short crust pastry base and topped with puff pastry sprinkled with cracked black pepper. There are the ways to do it in the oven, it says. Uh, you probably could do these in your air fryer as well, I dare say. Um, there are the ingredients. We've got beef, 30%. We've got a Longhorn IPA, 6%. The allergens are wheat, rye and barley and milk. In there, 400 grams, 2 times 200 gram pies. There's a warning, although every effort has been made to remove bones, some small bones may remain. Caution contains alcohol. That'll be, that'll be okay. You won't. You can. You can drive after eating these. You. You won't fail your breath test. So we've got a GB sticker there. Um. Yeah. So let's um. Let's get these. Any more information? Good. Good till March next year. Let's get these opened and uh, see what we have got. Yeah, I tell you, I really enjoyed making them sausage rolls. Um, I really did. I, I, I've got some. I've got great satisfaction out of actually making something. It was um, it was good. So the, we've got one upside down at, like normal, and one one the normal way. So that's what you get. You short. You've got your short crust bottom and your puff pastry lid with cracked black pepper. I knew I'd forgot something. I've missed out the extra additional nutritional information there. This pack contains two pies. Per pie, we've got 545 calories. 12.9 um, grams of protein. And um, if you want to pause that and have a look at that in more detail, then um, you go ahead. I did notice on the cooking instructions, it says for the further a touch, um, you can... Put some milk over the top. So I'm doing it, look. I'm, I'm actually, I'm doing it. So I'll get some milk on there. Like that, a bit more. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, absolutely perfect, look at that. Master chef, here we come. So it's going in and I've, I've milked the top. Going in the centre, 200 degrees, oh, don't worry I won't sing it, <laughs> on the bake setting, on the fan setting, for three, 35 minutes and I'll bring you back periodically. So they've only been, it's only been in, what has it been in, 15 minutes and I've noticed the lid is starting to burn. I'm, I've, I've knocked it down to 190 but I'm going to, I don't want that to burn now, I don't know if that's... I don't know if that's because I've I've put milk over it. So I'm gonna make it I'm gonna make it a little lid for it so it doesn't burn. I don't want that. I'm just gonna pop a little lid on it like that. Hopefully that'll stop it burning. Done. Um, with the last five minutes, I took the foil off the top, 
So, oh no. Look at that. Looks <laughs> like I'm going to be eating it, eating it out of the the foil tray. Well, it looks full there, doesn't it? Oh, never mind. Yeah, don't, don't worry about that. Well, so what I'm going to do with that, I'm, what, I'm going to take that off like that, and then I'm just going to pour that in the lid. Yeah. So that's your bottom bit. We can get a look at it now, and it'll cool down. Put that to one side. So it's got 30% 30% beef. There's your chunks of beef. We can get a good look at it now. Yeah. For a pound. I think it's less than a pound, isn't it? About 99 and a half pence. Some more beef in there. Bits of beef in there. Yeah. As it's been mentioned in the comments, you could get some bread and butter and stick that between bread and butter. <laughs> yeah. Smelling good. Plenty of um, slippage juice in there, that's for sure. Yeah. Plenty in there. Short crust pastry, puff pastry lid. Yeah, it's quite a bit of beef in that. I'm quite happy with that. Bit of brown sauce. And you're laughing. Load of chips. Oh yes. Hope you can see okay there. It's still really hot. Uh, I'm gonna try that bit now. Mmm. <laughs> oh yes. It's delivering. It is. Mm. It's rich, the gravy is rich. The beef is lovely and tender. Mm. Mm. Picking a little bit of that black cracked black pepper as well that's lovely that adds a nice little taste taste to it as well it's well seasoned plenty of gravy in there help it go down it's got longhorn IPA in there as well it's it, you can you, you, do, you know it's got beer in there it's, it's giving you that sort of a very faint in the background taste it's uh, steak and ale. We've all had them in the in the pubs, haven't we? Your local pub, you get a steak and ale pie, and and the lid is puff pastry, and it's normally about that big, isn't it? You take it off, and it's in like a, an earthware sort of pot. It's very similar to that. Obviously, the puff pastry. It was going a bit dark, so I had to sort of make a little hat for it, <laughs> a foil hat. Mm. Yeah, I like it. I do like it. Mm. Yeah, you can pick up that. I didn't think it would really make a difference, but you can taste the cracked black pepper on the puff pastry crust. You can. Um, it's it's alright for 99 pence or less than a pound. It's tasty. It uh, definitely hits, hits the mark. In an ideal world we'd love loads of, of beef in there wouldn't we? I did a pie from m and I've got a pie playlist. They'll all be in there. It was five pound for a steak pie. I think it was 200 grams. Five pounds for a pie. It was full of steak, mine, but a fiver, a lady Godiva. Mm. 
I like that. I do like that. I would um, I would would buy that again. It's nice. Good eight and a half out of ten goes to market. So thank you very much for watching and subscribing. Do appreciate it. Please keep the recommendations coming in. The last video I did, I really enjoyed making them sausage rolls. I am going to make some more. Well, I don't know what I'm going to make. But I am going to do some more cooking. Looks like you enjoy the cooking. If not for a laugh. <laughs> it's, it's, yeah, so I'm, not, I'm not a chef, I'm not a cook or anything like that. I'm just a normal person trying to just cook for the first time. Never really cooked. I've done a little bit over the years, but... Nothing you can sort of like learn from, if you know what I mean. Anyway, ooh, there's a bit of beef there. Look at that. Mm. Thanks for watching. Take care. All the best, and I'll get back to you on the next one.